This week we're looking at Mud on the Tires by Brad Paisley, specifically the solo of it, and even more specifically, the penultimate lick from it, which is this lick. <laughs> So um, this lick basically uses a technique which is the opposite of last week's technique. Um, last week we were looking at cascades and blending of notes using fretted notes. This week we're looking at cascades and blending of notes using open strings. Um, now the technique itself basically is where you take your scale um, from which the lick is derived. In this case it is the D major scale. Um, and you replace as many notes as possible using open strings. So in this case, we can actually change G, D, A, and E from the scale to be open strings. So if we were playing it as fretted, it would be like this. If we play it with open strings, it'd be like this. down into the lower register using some of the lower notes we can do this so we've got from going from the E all of the transcriptions for this stuff by the way is over on the patreon channel so let's take a look at the lick so what he does first is he's got a trill between the A, uh, the G and the A, back to the G, and then goes to an F sharp and bends it up to a G. So, okay. And then uh, after that, he goes open G to C sharp. And then you got the D and he flicks back from the F sharp to the E and then the open D. So. sharp and then bends to a G. Now if you manage to leave those open strings ringing just before you'll end up with a G power chord at the end. So, so as you bend you'll mute that A string that you played and the open D will be left ringing and then you've bent to the G making a lush G power chord. So Okay, that's your lick. Um, I obviously need to work on it as well. So, learn the lick itself, play it along to the backing track, and then once you've got the lick sussed as much as possible, try getting creative with it. Use the backing track to get creative with it. Try playing whatever it is that you come up with over the top of the backing track, and then for you guys that are really speeding through your homework then try and find a tune that is in the same key so d and try and use either the lick as it is if you can or get really creative and try and insert the technique of replacing fretted notes with open strings uh, into whatever solo it is that you're playing so that's your task this week um, as always, I'll be showing my progress just like I did last week. I'd really love it to see some of you, uh, if I could see some of your progress as well. So the way that you can do that is by going to my Instagram channel, which is Extra Guitar Lessons, um, and tagging yourself. Um, or you could um, direct message it to me if you're um, not comfortable doing it publicly, and then I can give you some free feedback either way. Anyway, hopefully you get on okay with this and uh, yeah, see you for next week's lick.